So let's dive in with this 1996 Lincoln penny. So what makes this penny so valuable? This seemed like an ordinary date, nothing special, 1996. But how come this one was sold for thousands of dollars recently? This is an uncirculated superb gem in unsinkable grade. That is MS69. Finding coin in such condition is almost impossible. The 1996 Lincoln Cent in MS69 red is a remarkable piece reflecting near perfect preservation level for modern coins with over 6.6 .6 billion 1996 cents minted. Finding an example in this condition is incredibly rare. Most pennies from this year show signs of circulation wear and environmental damage, making a pristine high-grade coin like this true standout in numismatics. Graded by PCGS as MS69 rent, this coin is just one step away from the highest possible grade, according to Sheldon scale. Red refers to the brilliant coppery hue still present on the coin, indicative of its fresh, uncirculated state. Over time, as you know, copper coins typically begin to tone, developing brown, or mixed coloration, but this example has maintained its original mint luster for nearly three decades. Coins graded as red are far more desirable than their red-brown or brown counterparts, contributing to these coins' high auction value. So, on September 15, 2024, this coin was sold at Great Collections Auction for over $4,500 a testament to its desirability among modern coin collectors. This sale reflects a growing demand for top-tier condition-sensitive coins and proves that even relatively recent coins can command significant premiums when in superb condition. Believe it or not, these buffalo nickel in circulated, worn and tarnished condition fetched hundreds of dollars at auction, exactly the same at Stax Powers auction. So what makes this seemingly ordinary nickel so valuable in numismatics? This is highly sought after 1937, the buffalo nickel, representative of three-legged variety, graded as VF35 by NGC, VF standing for very fine. This error occurred at the Denver Mint, where an over-polished die inadvertently removed the front leg of the buffalo on the coin's reverse. The striking mistake resulted in the distinctive three-legged variety which has fascinated collectors for decades. Despite its relatively modest grade of VF35, this example graded by NGC retains much of its original charm. In this grade, significant details of the design are still visible, including the strong profile of the Native American on the obverse and the majority of Buffalo's details on the reverse aside from missing leg. In these conditions, the coin shows moderate wear from circulation but remains highly desirable to collectors. The rarity and demand for this particular variety have made it a prized piece in buffalo nickel collections. The error likely resulted from mint employees' attempt to clean up a dye that had grown excessively worn and clogged. While the leg was inadvertently polished away, the coin continued into production before the mistake was caught and these coins were released into circulation. This highly coveted error buffalo nickel ended up selling for $720 on September 11, 2024 at Stax Powers Auction. The 1999 W. George Washington Death Bicentennial $5 gold coin graded PR70 Deep Cameo by PCGS is a modern numismatic masterpiece struck at the West Point Mint to commemorate the 200th anniversary of George Washington's passing, this coin stands out for its design, low mintage and flawless condition, made from 0.900 fine gold. This coin not only holds intrinsic value due to its gold content, but also carries significant historical and collectible worth. The PR70 grade is the highest possible signifying a coin without any visible imperfections, even under magnification. The deeper cameo designation highlights the coin's remarkable contrast, where the frosted design of Washington's bust and the other raised elements appear to float above the mirror-like fields. This flawless strike is a result of multiple strikes, with specially prepared dyes ensuring crisp, fine details 
and a stunning finish that collectors highly covet. In PR70 deep cameo grade, this coin is at the pinnacle of preservation. Coins in this condition command a premium due to its perfection, with, with values often exceeding thousand dollars. A combination of its historical significance, gold content, numismatic rarity makes a 1999 W. George Washington Bicentennial $5 gold coin an excellent choice for collectors looking to add a piece of American history to their collection. So this bullion gem ended up selling for $660 on September 11, 2024 at Stex Live Bidding. Yet another superb gem. The 1966 Lincoln Sand graded MS67 Plus Red by PCGS. It is a stellar example of the mid 20th century US minting. While billions of Lincoln Sands were produced in 1966, very few have survived in such remarkable condition. The red designation highlights a coin's vibrant coppery luster, retaining the same brilliance it had when it left the mint nearly six decades ago. An MS67 Plus grade is exceptionally high, meaning this sand shows no visible signs of wear or damage. The surfaces are virtually pristine with only microscopic imperfections under closed magnification. The plus symbol indicates that the particular specimen is at the top of its grade, almost pushing into MS68 territory, making it even more desirable to collectors who value the finest quality examples of common date coins. Despite its high mintage, the rarity of 1966 Lincoln Sand in such a lofty grade comes down to its survival rate in top condition. Most of these coins entered circulation shortly after being struck, exposed to handling wear and environmental factors that degrade their condition. Finding a coin with a flawless strike, rich red luster and smooth clean surfaces is extraordinarily rare. This exquisite gem exchange hands for over $8,300 recently at Great Collections Auction. As we wrap up this exploration of rare and valuable coins, I want to thank you all for joining me on this journey. If you enjoyed the video, please hit that like button. It really helps the channel grow. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications so you never miss an update on fascinating world of numismatics. As always, thanks for watching and God's willing, see you in the next video.